In the late winter of 1910, a relentless blizzard trapped two Great Northern Railway trains bound from Spokane to Seattle in the rugged Cascade Mountains. Six days of frantic efforts to reach the passengers and crews failed. Early in the morning on March 1st, an avalanche one half mile wide and 15 feet deep crashed down from the mountainside during a thunderstorm. It swept the trains off the tracks, killing 96 people. This documentary recounts America's worst avalanche disaster. February 23rd, the year was 1910 Sidetracked out of Leavenworth Waiting for the storm to end The engineer, he made the call They're sitting on those tracks We're going to Seattle, boys Oh, that mountain pass Now 30 miles up the tracks The mountainside lay bare Snow as deep as mother's love And cold as devil's stare our work day and night trying to clear the line We tried to sleep but huddled in fear of the next snow slide It's only snow at all It's only white death falling from the skies It's only death after all Lightning strikes flashing thunderous avalanches Train cars just keep crashing down, they fall. Nine days trapped on a mountaintop, nine days blizzard blue. Snow fell about a foot an hour, there's nothing we could do. March 1st, the weather changed, the snow turned to rain. Thunder shook the mountain and the devil made his play. It's only snow out. Strikes flashing, thunderous avalanche, train cars just keep crashing down. Fast mail train 27, we were 25. 96 bodies carried away, yet 23 survived. 100 feet below the bottom of a ravine, 40 feet of white death buried man and machine. Sometimes on a winter's night you can hear a whistle blow From high up on an icy ridge where no train could ever go And the voices whisper down the slopes searching for that train They'll carry them westward down the line on tickets that we pay It's only snow after all It's only white death Avalanche and train cars just keep crashing down. They fall. Train cars just keep crashing down. They fall. Train cars just keep crashing.